and Middle East, not Dubai, not Johannesburg, but Lagos, and he will do it. Otherwise, he has a lot of questions, questions to do from where he's coming. What is he going to tell the MIT alumni that he failed? That is a, he can't do that. I know what is happened to me. I couldn't explain it to anybody that failed, but I made a success of it. So I wish him all the best. And I know people in Lagos will be with him and with him. And I will back him up with our prayers. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, please. I'm going to do <laughs> from the Igbo who says he found love that he talks about so passionately so what will he do to promote relationships and help single people okay so, so, so the first thing <laughs> that is we'll it, do is a long question no? you oh, just wow. ask question he says will it make it easier for single women to rent houses so we can visit what will he do about traffic so Aja to Yaba will no longer be a long distance relationship People can't visit each other quickly by 1 a.m. due to insecurity. And we need more women in tech so they can spoil us with money. So this Fantastic. is, a, this is a, your, the type of constituent. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> no, but it's true. Because people don't realize the human side to bad governance. A man comes back, is coming back from home after a stressful day in the office. He's sitting there in three hours traffic. He comes back home, small arguments with his babe. He starts fighting, he beats her. Is a bad man for touching or raising his hands on a woman. Yes, I'm not making any excuses for domestic violence. Please don't, don't get me wrong. But I'm saying that life could be much easier if you didn't have to deal with that traffic, yeah. mm -hmm. right? And you don't know how much traffic has destroyed relationships oh, and homes. So, <laughs> oh, no, 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 we know. So, 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 so for us, we're going to tackle traffic, the traffic problem in Lagos. One, by dredging our waterways properly, okay. right? So that we can start to have ferry services. Okay. Because a lot of people don't use water transportation because of the small size of the boats and they feel that it can capsize. It's also a bad experience, right? <laughs> yeah, I've been in it. Like, it's yeah. Yes, yes. So, so what we need to do is have ferries that are more comfortable. You can drive on and then drive off. Have so car ferries? Yes, car ferries. ferries. No, both. Okay. Both. So you can choose to use your car and get on it. Or, you know, so you have proper connections. Secondly, I'm going to ensure that, I, for instance, I like the idea of, you know, the conversation about Aja. We're going to have a belt road that links um, Oniru VI all the way down to Bejeleki on one side. On the other side, it could do all the way down to Ekpe. And then we're going to link them by bridges six kilometers long. Right, so these, these are very easy, actionable things because these are not long bridges. But in doing this, we created the belt loop. It's a very efficient design for moving people around. What's it? Sorry. A belt Sorry, road. I, belt road. Road. <laughs> I mean, a belt, I'm not into urban design. Yes, like, a, belt, a belt road is like when you have a road that's doing like this and then it's connected. So like in London, you have the Thames. Sure. Right, and they have all the bridges, almost across 52 the tent, across. Just across. Right, so it interweaves. Very small. It's how he's smiling, architects. Like it interweaves. <laughs> I'm passing it. I'm passing it. it you know the exact number of bridges across. <laughs> it, <laughs> it interweaves the city. Yeah. As opposed to having like the third Milan bridge that's just like one, one long, long car sure. park. Okay. You want to come and do a fourth Milan bridge, another long car yeah. park. No, you have to have these interwoven type sure. of designs. I'm not saying that the fourth Milan bridge. Is completely is a complete disaster. Yeah, we'll look into it, other. but you need multiple, very well interwoven yeah. design. So there is that, and then also we're going to ensure that we start to reduce the number of cars on the road. We want to open up the BRT lane to private hailing companies because people are waiting for forty minutes, fifty minutes for a bus. That should not be the case. We don't have enough BRT buses, and the government should not be the only ones having to buy BRT buses. Yeah. Right? So the public se the private sector should be able to get involved because we need as many people, as many buses that can carry as many people on those lanes, right? And it's going to be a plug and play situation. You don't need to know the who is who in government. You have your bus, you respect it, start using the lane. Right? You pay whatever taxes or commission to the state. It's that simple. Plug and play. We're a government of platforms. Same thing with waste management as well. That is how. So P2B has thrown his support for Labour Party gov uh, governorship candidate of Lagos State, uh, Madebo Vive Rot. So he, what he said in this video, he said if uh, GRV should fail, what is he going to tell MIT alumni?
Massachusetts Institute of Technology, the, one of the top universities, top ranked universities in the world. Someone who graduated from MIT, you know, contesting for an election and losing. Though he has lost 2019 when he contested for the House of Senate, and now he's contesting for governorship. So if he should lose, what is he going to tell his colleagues, his, the alumni of MIT? So P2B is calling like, on Lagosians to throw away that ethnic and religious card that they are playing in Lagos and vote GRV because GRV will definitely win Lagos State if the obedience, if Lagosians should vote for him just like they voted for P2B. And I think, I believe that as well.